Chris Torrance, and I just received my Hyperduino kit in the mail from Roger Wagner, and I wanted to do a quick unboxing video uh, just to show you what's inside the kit and how you can use it in your own projects. So let's get started. Okay, so here we go. So the Hyperduino is a kit that you use to extend the Arduino. And uh, let's see, so the first thing that we want to open is the Arduino Uno. Um, so this is just your standard Arduino Uno. Uh, this is version 3 of it. And you can see it also comes with a USB cable. So here's the Hyperduino Shield Kit. And what this is, if we just look at the back of it, um, so it's a kit that comes with lights and sensors and it's designed to be hooked up to the Arduino and to be used for adding uh, things like lights and sensors and motors to some sort of um, say school projects or models or maybe like an art um, installation or something like that. So let's see what we have inside. So okay the first thing that's here is a volcano. Uh, presumably this will be used for some sort of demonstration uh, project. Um, here's a card with a uh, postcard for a discount, um, actually to get the bonus items if you uh, order another Hyperduino kit. Um, so some bonus items that came with it, here's a pen, this is a Hyperduino pen. Um, what else do we have in here? Okay, so here's a screwdriver, Phillips on one end and flathead on the other. Um, some LEDs so you can add lights to your kit, a whole heap of ribbon cables, um, some with just individual ones, and here's some uh, ones these look like eight pin, is that right, or six pin, six pin connectors. Okay, uh, presumably we use those to wire up. Um, here's some additional jumper cables, maybe these are for the motor or something. Um, a whole bunch of rubber bands. Not quite sure what those are for yet. Maybe just to tie everything together. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, here is a servo motor. Uh, so here's a servo uh, with a connector for that and a bunch of servo arms. Um, here's a motor, so you could hook that up to your projects. Um, there are some light sensors. Uh, so these are little photo cells you can use to uh, trigger when. I guess when the uh, the person puts their hand over it. Um, and what do we have here? Some more LEDs. I think these are, uh, maybe these are RGB LEDs. They look, they look a little fancier than the other ones. Um, let's see. And some more rubber bands. And here finally is the Hyperduino Shield. Uh, so let's open this up and take a look. Um, so if you're not familiar with a, a shield is basically the name for a board that's designed to fit over on top of the Arduino. Uh, so you can see here's the Arduino Uno and the pins on the uh, shield fit directly into the pins on the board itself and so you can actually stack these up to gain additional functionality. Um, and so the Hyperduino shield, what that really is, is it's essentially all the same pins as are on the regular uh, Arduino but in between each pin is a resistor that goes from the pin to ground and so this makes it really easy to add LEDs uh, to the Hyperduino in case you're doing projects with uh, LEDs you don't have to to wire up resistors or anything separately um, and it looks like it also has some uh, input pins there so you can hook up uh, say your photo uh, your photo cells to do um, like basically when a user puts their hand over something you could have it hook up to the computer and do something so that looks like everything that's in the kit, and maybe in the next episode we'll wire it up and see what we can do with the Hyperduino. Thanks for watching.